I'd still be, rather be the way I am now, though, and broke and a man of disrepute than the way I was and have that horrific internal struggle that I had. I was very suicidal for a while. I thought I was ruining Gail and ruining my children and ruining anybody that had ever loved me or trusted me. I thought I was a negative influence in the world and that the world would be better off without me. And the Bible says that Jesus came for the unrighteous. The Bible says that when one sheep wanders off, that Jesus will leave the 99 sheep that are together and go pursue the one. I was that one. So do you read the Bible differently now? Every day, and it means a totally different thing in the midst of suffering than it means. And to, 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 when you're in delight, you find portions of it that speak to delight and joy. When you're in suffering and pain, you find portions that speak to suffering and pain. When you struggle, you find portions that speak to that. It speaks to everything. Save me, O God, for the waters have come up to my neck. I sink in the miry depths where there is no foothold. I have come into the deep waters. The floods engulf me. I am worn out calling for help. My throat is parched. My eyes fail looking for my God. Those who hate me without reason outnumber the hairs of my head. Many are my enemies those who seek to destroy me. You know how I am scorned, disgraced, and shamed. I looked for sympathy, but there was none. For comforters, but I found none. Come quickly, O oh my God, to help me. Oh!